Hey, what's up, everybody? Chris Souter, Slender Cat Outdoors, back with you again this morning. Here with Jason Ricketts. Ricketts? Ricketts. Ricketts. Yep. Ricketts. I can never really say that right. <laughs> Team manager for Jackson Kayak. It's uh, just somebody I ran into at one of the fishing expos. He followed me, and now we're good friends. And not only good friends, we're going to become fishing partners today. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Get out here. He is in the uh, Big Rig HD FD. Yep, that's right. This thing's got a trolling motor on it. Yeah, the Torquedo 1103. It's a monster motor. It moves fast. Too, Let's see that bag of bait. We've got a bunch of fresh moon eye that I caught down at Green Up Dam yesterday, and uh, we're going to get after some blue cats. Back where we was at in the last video here at uh, Shawnee Marina, I uh, got a little bit of current, had another big rainstorm last night, and Jason, I hope it fired them up. Man, buddy. it is. You can tell the bait's jumping left and right. We're surrounded yeah. by bait. That's the yeah. sign. Bait fish are here. The the bigger fish are after the bait fish. Small skipjack. I mean, just a white bass. Yeah. I can't help but think there's blue cats underneath of them. So stick around. Let's see what we can do, Jason. <laughs> in the marina got a bunch of different baits I was able to catch a few of these little baby skipjack so I'm gonna put them on one just a couple a couple of those on a hook using five ounce weights today we're going with the current so we don't need a whole bunch of weight just kind of enough to keep it straight down probably get away with less but I like to have a little bit of weight on my rod. How far out are we going? Uh, we'll go out to where you see the the foam on the water. Yeah. We'll go from uh, go out there. And this one I sneaked in a gizzard shed. Caught it yesterday, but ain't real great still good still fresh so we'll use it here we go here we go oh I got I got two on <laughs> I had two on Just a little guy. Just a little guy. We'll take him to start though. Come here, little buddy. Just a little old feller. Yeah. yeah. start today. I got gum boots on today. Hip waders, steel plated, shin guards, chest guard, you name it. Come prepared. <laughs> New pair of grippers. Look at him, look at him. He must be brother to that one that got me last week. Quit it. Just a little old feller. We'll take him to start today, though. How big's that one? Uh, Jason down there wearing them out on me. <laughs> Talking to Jason about the fish that he was catching, and I'll be that going and catch another one myself. 
Another small little eater size fish. Little channel cat. Quit it. Just about grabbed him with my fingers again. Whew. I tell you what, this one stinks. My goodness, does he stink? <clears throat> well, he was hooked good. He wasn't going nowhere. Quit it. After getting that hook in my finger the other day, I decided it was time to do something different. I brought some gloves and these grippers. Right or not. Yeah. They're down in the brush now. Brownie. Okay. All right. Well, I will talk to you after a bit. Oh, got a good one. Oh, goodness. Man, I just marked a good in here, too. Did you? Yeah. He's just a wild one. <laughs> now he come up fast. We're not fishing real deep water, but oh man, he's wild. I'm gonna take it easy with him. Let him decompress. Keep him out of that other line. There he blowing bubbles now. Goodness sakes. Well, if this fish ever gets up to 40 pounds, he's going to be a handful. <laughs> oh, you got to love this stuff. Come here. Don't act a fool. Don't act a fool. See if I can get some grippers on here. There we go. There we go. Old Diachi done the job. <laughs> nice blue cat. Nice blue cat. Here comes the rain. That's a pretty blue cat. It is. Yeah, man. I'm even with Jason now. He's caught three and I've caught three. Can't let him beat me on my home waters. <laughs> <laughs> there he goes. But you know what? I got floatable glasses. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Got a free pair of glasses this morning from my man Jason. And they nice. What are these called? Coyote Flo Polarized. Coyote Polarized. They're floating, polarized, and they comfortable. Even for a big fat head like myself. CoyoteUSA.com. Look at them bad boys. <laughs> Styling, baby. Styling and catching blue cats. I know that's right. My whip picked up. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Did you guys hear the drag that was coming off of that baby? Oh. Oh yeah. Gosh. Oh 
Oh, yes. Yes. Yeah. 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 I don't know how I'm gonna do this, folks. <laughs> folks, we made a little change. Jason said he wanted to, he's, his biggest blue cap was 20 pounds. I'm gonna get this guy in before he breaks me off. I got gloves here somewhere. do this I've never in my life caught a fish this big in a daggone kayak Tell you folks what. There goes my daggone grippers. At least they're floating. <laughs> oh, what a mess. Wind is blowing us right into each other. <laughs> what a mess. This is much easier with a dip net. Golly! in a boat, baby. Yeah! Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh, man. Oh my gosh, man. One more. Oh my gosh, man. <laughs> Folks, I want you to look at that big old fat belly on that thing, son. Oh my gosh. One more close up. I'm coming. All right, folks, we're going to let this big old boy go. Man, what an awesome experience, baby. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> he just about flipped me over. Boom, baby. So I just released mine. I'm such a dummy. I had this rod laying over in front of my kayak in the water. Just released that big boy. 
and Jason's rod got smoked. He said it's just a little one, but it's a nice one. Looks like bait compared to what you just released. <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, a fish sandwich, man. I'm telling you what, man. It it's been a good day. It's been a good day. He just fish smacked. Boy, he made a mess this leader too. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> might be investing some of them rig wraps buddy rig wraps he likes them <laughs> I mean, if you guys don't have never messed with rig wrap stuff i've got rig wrap stuff all over this kayak because it's just super super easy you know if you've never fished in a kayak you don't have no room you, it's hard to do anything you guys just watched me try to hoist a 40 pound fish up in this thing and it was a hard chore to do but uh but it's fun and i'm bleeding again i'm bleeding again jason <laughs> that's why people are so drawn to this sport it's because it's not it's not just fishing it's combat fishing you yeah. know you're on you're right there with them you, know? you are <sighs> he ain't opening his mouth for me but there you go i gotta nice. weigh him and put him on the board yeah he needs to calm down a little bit Let's get back to fishing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. Whew, he just started peeling drag again. It is kind of loose. <laughs> Oh, wow, that was, man, I... <laughs> I'm telling you folks, this is absolutely ridiculous how much fun this is. <laughs> if you haven't tried it, if you got a kayak, go out give it a shot i mean i can't express how much fun this is now, this is a good fish battery's fooling me again another big channel cat probably a lot of bubbles coming up a lot of bubbles and i said we're only fishing in about 26 to 20 foot of water but uh another respectable fish oh and he just come off Oh well, that's the way it goes. Let's put it back down there see if we can't catch another one. Well, Jason, we had a pretty good day, buddy. We did. You, did. you enjoy yourself? I did. I'm worn out, man. For the first time in a long time, I'm cooked. Man. I've got slime all over me. Me too. I've got it. I've got it everywhere, man. We got, we got dead fish parts. I mean, look at that. Look at yeah. That. Stuff everywhere. But, folks, we had an absolutely good time today. Caught some really good fish. Yeah. Yeah. We did. We were smoking them. Yeah. I bet we probably caught, what, 15 between two of us? Probably. Yeah. You know, um, all of them are not going to make camera, but uh, yeah. But we got some really good footage. Uh, the biggest fish I've ever caught in a kayak, a stud 42-pound oh spawned out blue cat. It was a monster. The head on that thing still just, I was thinking about it when I was down river. I was like, man, that was the biggest head. It was awesome. It was monsters, <laughs> man. Awesome. So. But, folks, I want to thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you learned something. Hopefully you enjoyed this. If you did, please give me that thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button and share this video. I mean, this I love this kayak thing. And, <laughs> and, and you guys have asked me, why did I start? Well, I've always wanted to, but honestly, I met this man this year in Cincinnati. Yeah, February. And it, here, here we are, <laughs> you know. <laughs> I'm fishing out of a kayak, and it is a blast. I mean, I'm not going to be always fishing out of a kayak, but... Uh, you know, I do this to help everybody I, I honestly can. Uh, whether it's bank fishing, kayak, or out of a, you know, high dollar boat. It doesn't matter. Um, you know, I want to try to help each and every person that does that. So, yeah. hopefully you enjoyed. Jason, I had an absolute blast. I had an absolute blast too, man. Looking forward to the next time. Absolutely. Till next time, folks. God bless, and we'll catch you on the water.